I am about to do two of my least favorite things in the entire world. Number one, drive in the snow. Number two, go to Walmart during the daylight hours. I'm bringing you guys along for moral support. This is what's happening today. Lord help me not buy everything that lights up here. I want it all. That was an absolute madhouse and here's the part where I tell you I'm never doing that again. I could hardly film anything. There's people everywhere invading all kinds of personal space. This was too frustrating. I got myself and my mom both a pair of fleece line leggings. I am going somewhere very cold tomorrow. It's gonna be outside actually the next couple of days are going to be chilly outdoor activities so I wanted to make sure I got a good pair of fleece line leggings and I snagged a pair for my mom for Christmas and then I got stuff to make cookies tonight because I am weak. Guys I'm home. I survived a terrifying drive and I'm home. We made it. I'm awake. I'm alert. I'm alive. I got my new pants on. My fleece line leggings. I am in love with you so far. I might have to go back and get some more because they were like two for ten. It was so worth it. And I'm just going to relax and enjoy our beautifully decorated Christmas house right now. And then I'm going to make some cookies. Is anybody else like obsessed with their house at Christmas? I will like turn off all the lights and then turn on all the Christmas lights and I'll light a candle. And I'll just like sit there and just look around and be happy. Hello, my name is Jess and I am a total sucker for marketing. So I had to get these cookies. They're Batman and Wonder Woman. I will literally buy anything with like a superhero or Star Wars or Disney or whatever on it. Why am I like this? I already know these look better now than they're going to look after they bake and expand. I feel like every time I get cookies like this, they always look kind of wonky after they're done. Surprisingly not as ugly as I thought they were going to be. Ooh, eating is hard. Guys, I always buy these cookies and every time I make them, I take my first bite and I think, that kind of tastes like Play-Doh. On to the good stuff. Quick side note, please don't judge me for the break and bakes. I have just scheduled an epic cookie baking day with my mother. It will not be any kind of break and bake situation. It usually is like a solid 12 hours of just being like tits deep in flour. So today is my day to just like slack off and make superhero cookies and like Walmart brand break and bake and don't need your judgment, I just want my cookies. It's actually another day because I fell asleep on the couch in a cookie coma watching makeup videos on YouTube. I just want to show you guys what life is like in the Crane household right now. You are on blast. It is just a whole bunch of this. Just watching Chad play video games. You bought this for me for my anniversary. <laughs> well, we all have things we regret in life. So last night was our work Christmas party and in the white elephant gift exchange, I got $20, which is totally fine with me. So I took the $20 and my Ulta 20% off and went ahead and picked out my own like white elephant Christmas present. I always go into Ulta with like no makeup on. I feel like I always go in looking like a trash person and people always come up to me like, do you need help? I don't look like this all the time. I don't know why this is a choice I keep making, but I need to work on that. Anyway, so I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna show you guys the stuff I got today. I'm really excited about it. I've been gone for a couple hours and I'm just getting home. What do you wanna bet the chat is still inside playing video games? I stopped for a little bit. Liar. I didn't get this today. Anne actually picked it up for me the other day. But how hilarious is this RuPaul like prayer candle? 
I picked up this Empire Strikes Back sweatshirt from Kohl's. I think it's really cute. It's my favorite Star Wars movie. It's really fitting that I get it seeing as Star Wars comes out this week, but I love the little details on like the Tauntaun scene and then the Dagobah system. It's got Lando. I love this. I love this so much. I'm definitely going to wear it to the premiere on Thursday. And then I picked up two lip sets from Ulta. This one was on sale today for $21.50 and then I used my 20% off. So I got this for like $17.50 I think. And a full size lipstick from Lorac is $17. So I basically got five full size Lorac lipsticks for the price of one, which is pretty awesome. I think I might swatch these real quick. You can tell I've been swatching stuff at Ulta. My hand is always so stained when I leave that store. Okay, well these are all crazy beautiful. I love them all. Yes, what a deal. This is the Lorac Mod Goddess Alter Ego Lipstick Sec Volume 1. And the last thing I picked up is this Clinique uh, Pop Gift Set. Is that what it's called? Pop Party. And it has five minis in it. I have one of these pops. I think it's the Ruby one. I get compliments on it every single time I wear it. It comes in a super nice tin. And then we have five minis here. And I think they are different finishes too. Here are these ones swatched. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and end today's video here. Ed and I are going on a super fun Christmassy date tonight. I wanna get ready for that. I need to shower and uh, de-stain my disgusting lipstick arm. So with that being said, I'm off. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for being here and I will see you tomorrow. Bye.